Well, it's one of my favorite movies, and when I found out that you were putting it on the stage, I was wondering, how can you do that? It's a storyline that uh, I don't think fits the stage, but I'm so excited because QCT always does such a fine job, and I'm sure the adaptation is just going to be fantastic. It's one of those stories you almost have to see. In fact, for anybody who's going to see the stage play, I would say see the movie first, but it's really about a man who has a, tells stories. His son doesn't always believe them, but as life goes on, you find that some stories you can't make up. It's just one of those heartwarming stories that, uh, that is timeless. As I saw it with my son, we, we just loved the story, and I think it kind of reconnected us. We have the movie, and every once in a while we pull it out, but we've seen it a couple of times just getting ready for the, for the show. Our tickets are for the second Saturday, which is uh, March 24th. Just happens to be my mother's 93rd birthday. We have people coming in from out of town, so we had to get some extra tickets besides our, our usual tickets, and we're going to make a night of it. My brother, who spent uh, about 25 years in, in professional theater and dance, will be here from Boston, and we have some, some other family coming up from St. Louis, so we're bringing them in for the show. And it's kind of a reconnection of the father and son, but all the other characters, I, I just think it, it truly is kind of showing that family is really important. And so I think when you have a milestone like a 93rd birthday, having family around is, is important and putting it with the show makes it even better.